Hello and welcome to my Yu-Gi-Oh channel. Today we're looking at a brand new card coming out of Yu-Gi-Oh Rush Jewels. This is Eternal Freeze. It's a normal trap card with the requirement when your opponent normal summons a monster and must have 2500 or higher attack. You can activate this card by sending one monster you control to the graveyard. And the effect is to place that normal summon monster on the bottom of its owner's deck. That is a brutal effect. Your opponent has to have a monster that's normal summoned with 2500 or higher attack. That means they're most likely going to be level 7 or higher monsters. You might have some maximum monsters that require several tributes to summon them. And the only cost is you have to send a monster you control to the graveyard. So long as you can do that, you essentially put their monster back to the bottom of the deck, making it almost impossible for them to search that out again until they can actually shuffle their deck. This, I really think, actually is very appropriate for a name, Eternal Freeze. It puts them literally on ice. It stops them from going into some of their signature cards. I would say the only downside is it's only for normal summons. So as special summons become more prolific, and as we get further into Season 2 and into Season 3 of Yu-Gi-Oh! 7s, there is going to be a lot more special summoning outside of normal summons. So for the time being, this is definitely something I'd advise running multiple of if you can get them. But I wouldn't consider this card to be that powerful for that much longer. It would have been amazing if this had been introduced at the beginning of Season 1, but we are where we are. Konami rarely releases cards at the time where they're most usable, so there's always that to consider as well. Whatever you think of this card, please those, leave those comments down below. I'd always love to see your opinions on these. Like the video if you enjoyed it, and don't forget to subscribe for more daily Yu-Gi-Oh! content.